Now, I know a lot of people don't realize this, but one of the biggest deterrents to someone obtaining any kind of sobriety in their life is looking at who they're surrounded with and trying to break away from the culture of drinking uh, because it becomes uncomfortable. You have to get out of your comfort zone and you become weird within your group of friends or even within your family. And it's weird to try and to stop drinking. Now, everyone knows that drinking in excess is not good for your body, but everybody is not in the same place. So if you find yourself wanting to get out of that situation, uh, your friends, unfortunately, will resent you. They will take it personally. They, they will say, you know, you're not drinking. Oh, just have one more glass with us. Just, you know, just have some fun with this just for tonight. And the fact of the reality is one glass can lead to 10 and you know that and you're trying to break away from that. Breaking away from uh, relationships that are superficial is the first choice you should make as an alcoholic and realize that fair weather friends uh, are not going to you know, go down the same path that you want to when you, make, when you have decided to make the decision and the leap forward to find sobriety. And I think what's even more difficult is when it's the same situation with families you, know, you have a holiday and there's 10 bottles of wine, there's a whole liquor cabinet sitting on the counter for everybody to uh, you know, take their turn with. And if you don't drink, you know, you're looked at almost as a pariah uh, and they don't understand that because they're not ready themselves. And if you're, you know, the first thing you have to do is realize you need to get around different people. And as difficult as that may be, we're talking about your life here. Okay, and if you need to be around different friends and maybe separate from your family for a while in order to obtain sobriety, these are decisions, conscious decisions that you've got to make. Now, being aware of who you're surrounded with and, and making the conscious decision to separate from that, that takes a lot of courage to do that. I mean, that's not something that everybody is able to do, but being aware of that is the first step and maybe separating yourself physically and emotionally from that is a key point you know and back that up with group therapy and you know all the other things that are available uh, i certainly can help you with that i identify what's going on in your life and in your family and we pinpoint that and we take action the important thing here is you need to take the correct action and change in your life because if nothing changes nothing's going to change so if this is a scenario that you have found yourself in and you genuinely want to make some changes, click on the link above, schedule a breakthrough call, and let's find a path to sustainable sobriety. You know, again, I've helped thousands of alcoholics, and just as importantly, I've helped their families. Click on the link, set up a breakthrough call, and again, thanks for listening.